So this is how I made the bow tie bunting. Um, first I cut out, first you have to pick all the pieces of paper you want, the colors. Um, Asher's birthday color theme is orange and blue. So um, first I cut out some cool bow tie paper and I just kind of made it up and cut it out like that. You're going to need some buttons and you're going to need some cardstock. Okay, so for the first thing I'm going to do is take my paper and fold it in half and just don't crease it all the way down but just on the very bottom crease it so you know where the center of your paper is and then you're going to cut it from um, that crease to one of the corners and you do the same on both sides so now you have the triangle and then you have these two little pieces which you're going to use for the collar so I use different color paper so that the collars would be a different color. So you take the um, little pieces from a different paper and you put it on whichever colors you want. Those are all mine over there. So um, then you take the piece and you put it on like so. And you kind of figure out how you want it. So that's the collar. And then what I did is I kind of just turned it over and traced where it was and then cut that out so then you end up with this and then what I wanted is I wanted this part to be a little bit steeper so I just cut that out and ended up with that and then you just um, so this part's a little bit steeper um, so then you just copy that and use that as your template for the other side so here it is on the darker one I just and then what you do is you glue this down, and then you add your bow tie. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. If you're anything like me, you'll forget which side goes on which side, so like which way this goes on here. Um, the best way to remember is this short side goes towards the outside. That's what I figured out, how to remember that. So yeah, then you just put on your bow tie, and then um, I just super glued three buttons on. I have this big set of buttons. And so I just pick three out in random order and glue them on. And that's it. So here are the ones that I made. And it's going to be the backdrop for a photo booth. I think it'll be cute. 